Hello guys, Luke here, welcome back to the channel. Today we're resuming our series of Vanishing Realms, a uh, RPG fantasy game for the HTC Vive. So I thought I'd do another episode. It's been a little while since I've done a VR video. Actually, the last VR video I did was this game. And it's really uh, one of the best like RPG style uh, VR games there is on, on Steam. So let's keep going. Um, last episode, we managed to buy a sword. I think it was around 400 gold we had to spend to get that. Uh, we still have 348 gold. Um, and we have a couple of bits of food, uh, bread, cheese, a torch, uh, which I always like to have out because it's really handy. You can burn leaves and curtains and stuff. You can also burn enemies too. Uh, if an enemy walks onto like a pile of leaves like that, you can actually set it alight and it'll burn the enemy. I'm going to now have to turn away from the camera because this is the way forward. <laughs> it's a little bit annoying, but here we go. Um, I don't think I need my sword right now. I'm just going to put it away and my torch. Um, okay, we got... Some water. Obviously, we can't traverse the water. There's a cough, floating coffins here. Oh, there's a healing potion over there. Well, I guess we'll go over and pull the lever. Ah, oh, good, that drains the water. Oh, we are up very high now. Is there a way to lower this? Oh, we can just jump down. Okay, sweet. Oh, money. Don't mind if I do. Well, I think we do actually need our sword now because these coffins, we can actually open them up. Oh yeah. Got anything else? Nope. Thank you very much. Ah, oh, some coins too. Sweet. Did I miss some? Yeah, I did. Thank you. You got coins for eyes. Okay. <laughs> uh, there's one more coffin here. Oh, okay. There's nothing in that one. Um, okay, so if we need health, we can buy a health potion, but I don't believe we need one. All right, we can pull this now. Whoa, it was in my face. Oh yeah, so now we should be able to walk over there. Yep, we can. Sweet. And anything else? Anything out of reach? No. All right, let's move on. We've got some decent treasure there. How much money are we up to now? Oh, we're up over 500 gold again. Excellent. And we have a bit more here. Another coffin. Sweet. <laughs> Just some floating gold there. Okay. Some more treasure here. Oh, I've got to move away. There we go. Yeah, the downside of recording VR guys and using the green screen as well is that uh, the amount of room that I have to move around is limited because um, obviously I can't have the green screen too far back in the room, otherwise uh, it'll capture the sides, like the walls. Anyway, you guys don't have to worry about that. When the video is actually edited, you shouldn't be able to see any any of the room that's actually not a green screen. Oh, what's... hold on. I missed something there. Ah. There we go. Treasure, thank you. Uh, where did that, where did that piece of treasure go? Oh, I missed some coins there. What the hell? Where's... Oh. Nothing there. Bloody hell. It, it went through the floor or something, I don't know. Damn. Oh. We got plenty of money. I'm gonna open this coffin up. Holy crap! Alright, on guard. Right here, you bastard. Ooh, nice. Some gold down here as well, I didn't notice that. I get my exercise for the day, guys, playing VR. <laughs> Having to crouch a lot and swing my arms around. This place looks a bit mysterious. <laughs> Leave the sleeping to a dying dream. No thanks. I'm gonna just come in and make a ruckus and get all your gold. Thank you very much. Ooh. Couldn't get off my hand. There's a piece up there. I have to try and knock down. Oh. Fallen swordsman, eh? Well, you can wait. Actually, you're 
you're standing on a pile of grass. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh. Well, I burnt. Oh, yes. Keep keep walking over that. Yes. Keep walking over it. Come on. Ah. <laughs> Uh -huh. Got him down to half health already. All right, what do you got? Whoa. Whoa. Oh, well, with the fire, we got him down to half health. That was great. I get that gold and get my old torch back. All right. What were we doing? Oh, yeah, we're trying to get this, eh? All right, this is going to be hard because I'm going to hit my ceiling probably. Ah, oh, nearly. Gotcha. Sweet. Oh, it took me three bloody torches to do it. Let's put them back in there. Okay. You're not going to come to life, are you? Oh, yeah. Um, food, yeah. Why not? I don't think there's any limit to how much you can actually carry in your inventory. All right. Oh, there's a big treasure up there, too. All right. What the? What the hell? <laughs> Not again. Can I actually stand here and just... Oh. Oh, what? The sword can't get it? Come on. That's a little bit of bullshit there. Can this guy do anything? No. Okay. I guess we're going to have to use our torches again. Ah. Oh. Oh wow, you can climb. Ah, oh, sweet. You can climb the chain. Can I get my torch back there? So, I never, I've played this game before guys. I haven't finished it before, but I've played it before and I never knew you could climb stuff. Awesome. All right, have we got everything in this room? I am trying to get all the treasure guys because it is important for later. You have to try and buy other equipment like a shield and stuff like that. I'm not gonna spoil it too much. I won't say what else you can buy, but yeah, we'll need it for later. Let's get my sword out just in case. Got a dead guy here, he's got nothing on him. You got nothing on you either. Oh, we got a guy with a crossbow. Oh, what? It went through the pot. Whoa, that was close. Oh, how did he miss me? Thank you. There you go. I'll just wait till I hear him fire the, the arrow, then I'll move. Like so. <laughs> um, unfortunately, we have nothing to hit him with yet. Oh, we can block it with a sword. Awesome. Whoa, that went far. Oh, that's awesome. Can we actually... Ah, oh, too bad we can't deflect them back at him. That'd be awesome. Close. Uh, I don't think it'll work. Let's try it again. Oh, missed. I don't think that's gonna work, guys. Oh, we got a guy up there. Okay. Nothing in that pot. I don't know how he missed. Whoop. Actually, instead of dodging, I'll just be, um, I'll just deflect them. Easier. Oh, we got a gate. Oh, yeah, there's a lever there. There we go. You can't see it here. Sweet. Oh, he's breathing. I, I could hear breathing. It's him with <laughs> the guy with the crossbow. Oh, hello. Gather strength upon these grounds in mortals trade steel for treasure found. Um, yeah, right. How much for a shield? 200. Yeah. I'm just gonna burn these curtains first to see if there's anything behind them. No. Oh, mana potion. Okay. Oh, we got too much in there. Let's put something there. There we go. Sweet. Um. Okay. We've just spent 200 gold to get a shield. Oh, I guess it's um, a way that we can block the arrows. Let's go up the stairs. <laughs> stairs. It's a ladder, actually. Um, might actually put my shield... Oh, where's my... Oh, there. 
It's weird. Sometimes the, the inventory belt like moves around my body. I'm not sure why that is, but it's a little bit awkward. Just so it's easy to see, we can have a torch out, you know? All right. Oh, there's one there. How do we get to that? Oh, actually, we, oh, we can walk across there, so we'll be able to reach it. Looks like. Can we... Oh, we can... Ah, oh, sweet, we can climb. I didn't... Like, I never knew this before. I played this heaps, but... Oh, we have to use both hands. But now we're gonna... Oh, he's gonna shoot us. Oh, wow. I never knew this before. So that's one way you can actually get past this obstacle. Um, the other way was just walking across there, but of course the guy can shoot you with arrows. Wow. Wow. Oh, you tried shooting at us. Let's get our sword out. Any more treasure before we go? Nothing there. Whoa, close one. Whoa, another close one. All right. Can't hit us from there. All right, there's a couple of dudes coming up. We're gonna have to get our shield out, I think. But first we have, yeah, we got a couple of dudes. We got the spider web here. Oh, there we go. I don't know why it keeps a bottle up there. Is this guy gonna fire crossbows at us as well? All right. I'm gonna get our shield out. Here we go. Come on. Easy peasy. You're next. One more hit. Should do it. Gotcha. Sweet. Oh, we got a third guy there as well. How are we going to get that? Oh, I guess we'll get to him later, that crossbow guy. Need a torch back out. There we go. Easy to see. All right, mate. Ready for you. Bring it on. Oh, what? This guy sucks, he's wearing a helmet. Ugh. I think this game wants you to have the sword in your left hand. I keep having to swipe across the body because he's got his shield on that side and he never moves his shield, so I have to keep swinging like backhand. But it's not too big a deal. I prefer sword in my right hand, so I'll keep going with that. And I've got a few more pots here. Oh, now you can shoot us. Piss off. We need a projectile. Whoa, shit, that was close. We need a projectile of some sort. I think we're about to get to him anyway. Can we actually, oh, look at that, we can jump down. What's over here? Oh, there's a lever. What the hell? Oh, it opens that door. All right, any more treasure? Before we go. Nah, looks like we just jumped down here. All right, come here, you bugger. What the? Son of a gun. He was annoying. He's too, he's too armored. <laughs> oh, hello. You were guarding some sweet coin. Oh, wow. That's coin as well. Jeez. Any more? Nope. Oh. Hmm? Look at this, guys. We get a bow. Oh, we got a checkpoint as well. Awesome. Whatever, man. He's just droning on at this stage. All right. Uh, we've got plenty of money with a thousand, over a thousand gold, so. Oh, wow. 
Right, I want, uh, hold on. I want it in this hand. Sweet. And, um, we have infinite ammo, right? Yep. Can't see any more treasure. There's a weird skull door there. Fires are already lit. Oh. Locked within a king, a tomb. I stand before wrath and doom. Show me a wand to go beyond. The magic hides in forest gloom. And then there's a arrow pointing that way. Okay, so it looks like we can't get through this door yet. Can we? No. No, we can't interact with it at all. Um. <laughs> How's that? How's that feel? Oh, I went away. No hidden treasure up here? No. Alright, so the only way to go is either back that way or here. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, I love bows. They're awesome. Look at that, now we can go through. Oh, we've got a mine here. Well, I'm... I think I'm a bit too tall for this cave. Let's get our torch out. Mmm, shiny. Can we, can we have, please? I can hear, I can hear something. I'm gonna keep my sword out. I like how the game's getting more open now, and not so just focused through corridors, you know? Oh, look at the sky. Beautiful. The skybox is very nice in this game. And keep in mind, guys, this is one of the earliest HTC Vive games that was released, uh, very early on. Oh shit, there's an... Shit! Okay, there's an archer there. Um... <clears throat> uh, put that away. There we go. Dodge here. Gotcha. Sweet. Easy peasy. Oh, did he drop money? No. Okay, good. Because I can't get up there. Ooh. Yeah, this game loves to hide treasure just everywhere it can. What the hell is this? Trespass, moonlit, midnight path. Undead hulk shall rise in wrath. Beyond the wand, a crystal cave. To haunted swamp, to castle grave. I, it's giving me directions, but as if I need directions. It's a, it's a game that's pretty narrow. Like it is, you just follow the path that's already there. Um, all right, there's some apples. Take food. We haven't really needed food because we don't we don't really get hurt um, much. If at all. Um, so there's nothing back that way, nope. With our bow in hand. There's a path down there. Okay. There's apples on the trees as well. Oh, hello. Shit. That was close. Oh, what? That was right in the head. Oh, bullseye. It's very hard to hit his face. Got that freaking head on. There's actually apples in this tree. Oh, can we can we hit him? Oh, you can. Ah, oh, sweet. Let's do that. Oh. That's the thing about VR shooting, guys. You don't have a reticle. It's just like, oh, what? That was weird. Oh, I thought it bounced off the apple. There we go. Is this an achievement or something? Must be. Ah, oh, no more apples. I guess maybe we have to shoot a certain amount of uh, apples and then we get an achievement. Oh, hello. Barrow ringed by standing stones, arrows loosed from hands of bone. Sorcery guards the midnight pyre, enshrined beyond a wand of fire. So this is all leading towards us getting a magic wand, I guess. We're, we're joining Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. We are Harry Potter. You know, before he, before he turned 11 years old and was able to join, he, he wielded a, a sword and a shield and a bow. Yeah. <laughs> we could pick up all the apples, but we got so much freaking food. <laughs> we don't, don't really need it. Um, all right, let's go. And uh, the only way we can go, this way. Oh, it's another archer. Oh, sweet, we can hide here. Where are you going? He's hiding as well. Oi, come back. Oh, 
pain in the ass. Gotcha. Ah, you are too easy. All right, so there's more apples in this tree I just noticed, guys. So we're gonna try and oh, shoot them as well. How many do I have to shoot? Yeah, um, ninth apple. So I'm guessing ten, maybe ten apples. Tenth. Uh, still nothing popped up, guys. So um, I don't actually know if Steam achievements. Oh shit! Let's beat you first. Oh, headshot. Yes. That looks like a trap. As I was saying, guys, um, I don't know if Steam achievements actually pop up for me, like on on my on my user interface, but uh, if there are, I guess you guys will see it, and I'll see it in editing. I'll see you in hell. Oh, you both missed. Oh, helmet shot. Gotcha. Too easy. The bow is really nice. Um, I did get the better bow, by the way. This was, how much? 500 gold. The cheaper one was 200. So this must do more damage or something. Um, I'm looking for apples. <laughs> this this is a trap, for sure. Look at it. It's got like a an area where it can sense movement. Let's look around more first. I feel like we're going to get swarmed by enemies. Oh, sneaky treasure. I mean, any more? No. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh, what's that? There's a locked door up there. There's a checkpoint there. I guess that's that's where we're going to end the episode, guys, over there. But we're first. We're going to do that middle bit. I'm just looking around first. Hello, another note. Thieving dwarf hides secret key. Cursed in darkness shall he be. Vengeful hands make magic sign to steal his fate in precious mine. So it's. I don't know why it has to say it this long, but there's a dwarf somewhere hiding that has a key. Okay. Uh, Got a torch. I mean, you can never have too many torches. So, a dwarf has the key, and then we can get the wand. And oh shit, Dragonfire wand, fifteen hundred gold. Uh, we have we have nearly a thousand gold to go. Jesus. All right. So there's no nothing else to do except go into the middle here for now. There is a path over there. I noticed. Um, there's another cave, so we'll have to go through there soon. Uh, sword and shield, or. Yeah, I might get sword and shield for now, guys. Because at least if there are archers that pop out, we can get some deflections with the shield. All right, here we go. What the? Huh? Is that it? Two. All right, we need the bow. Oh, Look at this guy. What? I don't, I don't know what that guy did, but you're next, mate. Die already. Is this meant to be a boss? This is just... That was disgustingly easy. What the hell are the game designers thinking behind that boss? What did he drop? Anything good? Oh. Oh, hello. Couple of swordsmen. Oh, and an archer. Oh, we can get some sneaky shots on him. Oh. Ah, you sneaky bugger. What? Aha, gotcha, yep. <laughs> we can kill this guy without actually. Oh. Damn it. Do that again. Ah, you yep. stopped walking. Ah, gotcha. Sucked in. Ah. Do, th do that yell again. Go on. Do, do it again. Come on. Alright, we're going to have to go fight this guy. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Go on. Too easy. Oh, that other guy didn't drop any gold. Damn. All right, let's get our prize now. I think we can enter here safely. 
Maybe. Can we? Nothing's gonna happen. A couple of mana potions. Plus 10 permanent health burn, that's excellent. Can always do some more health. I was actually thinking before, our health is actually quite low. We need have 40 max health right now. We have a bunch of mana that we can't even use till we get the wand, I'm guessing. Uh, is there any other treasures? Ah, uh, there are more apples. All right, we're gonna shoot them just in case we get an achievement or something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm meant to be doing. I can't see any more apples on that one. All right, and we will get this checkpoint for now. I'm guessing we'll have to go, yeah, uh, into the cave, find this dwarf, get the key off, and then we can get the wand. Then we can go with the wand back to uh, that door with a skull in it that wants magic to enter. Uh, let's go and save here. Checkpoint, saved. Okay guys, that's gonna do it for another episode of Vanishing Realms. Um, so, so far we're making a little bit of progress here. We got a bow, uh, the best bow that you can get so far. And of course we got the shield. I forget what the actual name of it was, but anyway, we got a shield, which is gonna come in really handy later. I'm, I'm wondering if this can deflect uh, magic as well. So yeah, anyway guys, next episode we'll hopefully get the one from the from the cage up here, get the key from the dwarf, get the wand, and then we'll be able to cast some magic. All right guys, that does it for this episode of Vanishing Realms. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, leave a like down below, subscribe for more content like this, and I'll see you guys around the channel. All right, have a good one.